What's going on everybody? King Friday here. I hope you're having an amazing day today. So I've got something really exciting for all you tech enthusiasts and connoisseurs out there of digital signage, because I'm gonna be taking a look at the Samsung QMC series, specifically the 50 inch variant of this display. I'm also gonna show you how these displays, which were made for digital signage, pair seamlessly with Samsung's Magic Info cloud-based digital signage platform. So let's get right into how Samsung is completely changing the game for digital signage. Samsung Samsung was nice enough to provide me with a beautiful display and with a couple of cables and just a little bit of configuration, it was already popping up on Magic Info. This is all thanks to Magic Info being cloud-based, but you can run it on-prem if you want to. But because it's cloud-based, this means that I can essentially take control of this display anywhere that I have an internet connection, which is super convenient. The display is an ultra slim 3840 by 2160 Ultra HD display. It is a matte finish, so it cuts down on glare. And since it's made with digital signage and video walls in mind, it has an extremely thin bezel. They didn't even put the Samsung logo on the front like they normally do. Well, I mean, but it's on the back, so it's okay. It's got all the fixings for IO, as you know, it's gonna have HDMI, display port, it's got audio inputs, it even has a NIC port for hardwiring your internet connection, so you don't have to rely on Wi-Fi. And speaking of networking, this actually has a 10 gigabyte onboard storage chip. So it allows you to be able to store a lot of your digital signage right on the display. So if you don't want to be in a always online type of situation, you don't have to be with this display. If you ever unplug it and take it off the network and put it somewhere else, the display will just pull that signage back up again. The Samsung QMC series is the perfect balance between performance and price, and it is perfect for any type of workflow that needs dependable but flexible signage. All right, so let's talk content now. So I had a lot of fun diving into Magic Info. It was actually my first time ever getting into this platform. So I had a blast trying to sort of put it through its paces and see all of the types of things that it can do. So with Samsung's Magic Info, I can add all different kinds of content to my display whenever I want to. So I can add video, photos, streaming video, web pages. I can even add the weather updates if I want to. It's amazing. So Magic Info actually comes with this really cool tool that I want to show you. It's called Web author. So it allows me to be able to create all different types of signage without being some crazy content designer, even though I'm a content designer. So it actually has this really cool widget in here uh, that allows you to be able to choose the geolocation of where the digital signage is, and then it will actually choose a photo background of that city and put it behind the time of day and the temperature. And it's just it's just a cool little thing that Samsung decided to throw in there. I, I think it's neat. So everything can be scheduled out smoothly using the schedule tab. So need specific content rules, the rule set tab has me covered. This level of control allows me to be able to know for a fact that all of the different types of content that I have are going to hit the screen the right time every time. So if you want to schedule out messages or if you want to put a one-off message directly to a display, you can do that. You can put it up there like any other piece of content. And you can actually set up events that are outside of the normal scope of your content to add a moment of exclusivity, if you will, for you know different advertisements or brands. And with features like real-time health monitoring, I'm able to check and make sure that the display and the player engine is all running smoothly no matter where I am. And with detailed reporting and putting all of the data in charts, it allows me to see just how my digital signage is being used at all times. Samsung digital signage basically becomes a part of your sales and marketing team by having this type of functionality put into it. So one of my favorite digital signage stories to tell is I was walking into this chain restaurant, I won't say who it is, but basically I walked into order and I saw up on their menu board, they actually had their unattended remote access client with the creds visible right over top of the entire menu. So hilarious. It, I, essentially, I could have taken a picture and then put the creds into the into the client. I knew which client it was and I would have been able to have full control of the thin client or whatever type of digital signage platform they were using, which is hilarious. You know, there are IR sensors in most displays. So, it, you know, it's really easy for nefarious characters to be able to get in there and, you know, start messing with your stuff. But Samsung has thought of that too. So let me actually show you. They have a really wide range of security controls that make sure that your display is locked down and only controlled by the people that you want to control them. So managed organizations allow you to be able to hand off the control of certain displays 
displays to the certain people in your team, which is actually perfect for organizations that have internal content teams that you know need access to displays, but maybe they don't need access to every single display. So this is actually one of the coolest features that I've ever seen in any type of digital signage platform. They actually have a virtual remote that allows me to be able to control any display connected to the server. So it's kind of like having a magic wand, actually. So where does the QMC series and Magic Info land in the digital signage landscape, per se? So the great thing about using Samsung displays is the fact that if you're using Magic Info, it allows you to be able to use a smart display instead of a dumb display with a digital signage platform put on top of it. The digital signage was made to work with the digital signage platform. So from soup to nuts, you have full control of the signage platform and the digital signage itself, which is amazing. So whether you need to schedule everything out and have a completely hands-off approach, or if you wanna go a little bit more hands-on, Magic Info and the Samsung QMC series, essentially it has you covered in whatever type of way that you wanna use it. So there you have it, setting up the Samsung QMC 50 inch digital signage display and magic info. It's an absolute breeze. I highly, highly recommend it. And if you have any other questions, be sure to reach out to your Exertus Alamo representatives, the fine folks over there. I know they will be happy to help you and to point you in the right direction on which type of Samsung display you should get. So remember in the digital signage space, it's all about telling stories. And Samsung has solutions for every type of vertical that needs quality, flexible, and dependable digital signage. So I've been King Friday. I'll catch you guys on the next one. Yeah.